three, I, I ascribe to the pack mentality. But the pack mentality, as far as, please feel free to jump in here on this, okay? The pack mentality, as far as a hierarchical structure, okay, that this is the alpha, the beta, the gamma, and, and, and that's a set, and, and that's a set hierarchy, ridiculous. To the extent there is a hierarchy, it's always context sensitive anyway. So that you can have, my dog Beans will give in to Annabelle on every single issue until there's a really yummy food thing there. Mm -hmm. And now Beans, eh, you can get put up with that anymore, okay? Annabelle is not going to walk over near that, near that little food scrap. Right. But in everything else, she's number one. Yeah? I just want to add the pack mentality theory came from the idea that dogs should just take wool. Yes. Right. And <clears throat> they, they researched, the latest research in that has shown that the, even in wolves, it's not a, a, a consistent alpha, first, second, third, the pecking order, which is what we refer to, it's not stable in a wolf group either. And as far as dogs not liking one dog over another, I can tell you that dogs have definite opinions of who they like and who they don't like. Yeah, yeah. And there's sometimes no rhyme or reason to it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They have likes and dislikes just like we do. They have, they're, they're cognitively more like us than people have ever realized. They, yeah. They're capable of, of episodic memory, of metacognition. I mean, these are things, the recent discoveries now that have been proven that uh, are phenomenal when you think about it. So they have their opinions, <clears throat> and, they, and there may not be a reason why they like or dislike somebody that we can tell. Right. But like I tell my clients, you don't know that one dog's not sending visual daggers to another dog that's instigating. I mean, <laughs> there's stuff that goes on we don't know about, smells that go on we don't know about, sounds we can't hear, and visual communications. So you can't really pigeonhole any situation and say, oh, it's pecking or packing or pecking. You've got you to look at it individually. Yeah. So. That, that makes perfect sense to me. 